<laughs> Hi everybody, this is Ron, Gadget Man, coming at you again. Today is June the 11th of 2011, and today we have the distinct pleasure of having, does she have a name? So a nameless winch has fallen into my driveway. That's a 69 uh, Chevy C20, right, with a 305, I think, a 350 in it, and, uh, oh, Edelbrock. Can we open this? Uh, this is Lance, he's the owner. Uh, you see, it's got a high performance Edelbrock 640 on it, and uh, we have not even rejected it. Let's see how smooth it's running. Alright, now let's look at the emissions. Guys, that's a carbureted vehicle without a catalytic converter. It was in the thousands before on the hydrocarbon values alone. We have seen them here as low as, what, 60? How low did we get it down to? 62, I yeah. think. Yeah, 62 on the emissions. We had to tune it back to get everything right the way it was. But anyway, that's the emissions. Now, I'm going to let the owner introduce himself and tell you about his truck and a little bit about his adventure with the Gadget Man Group. <laughs> um, that truck there, that's the original motor. Who are you? I'm Lance McGraw. All right, tell us about your truck. This is my truck. Um, <laughs> it's a three-quarter ton truck, so it's a heavy beast. And that's the original motor, so it's 40 years old. We put it normally when I have to go through emissions, I have to put a little, I have to put about a gallon of alcohol in the tank <laughs> to get it to even pass. Uh, this time, after getting grooved, we were able to pass without even tweaking with the, with anything, mm -hmm. nothing, normal gas, everything, and it passed with flying colors. Mm -hmm. And even better than that, it normally got 13 miles of the gallon. It's now getting 18, which is 38 percent increase in my mileage. So and we I'm haven't thrilled. even. We haven't even rejetted yet, have we? No, I'm thrilled. Awesome. <laughs> you gonna go down and get some smaller jets? Yeah, we're gonna try some more stuff. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I told him I'd get him over 30 miles to the gallon. What do you think? Uh, yeah, awesome. <laughs> All right. So, uh, how about the horsepower and stuff? Oh, it's great. I mean, the throttle response is nice. It's actually even better, mm -hmm. and so we're having a lot more fun. All right. All right. Good. So, do you recommend this to other? Carburetor vehicle owners? Oh, absolutely, especially if you own classic cars like this one. Uh, yeah, and I, I this, problem getting through emissions. Yeah, did this used to be your grandpa's? Yes. Okay, all right. So it's a family-owned vehicle. All right. Well, guys, listen. A little groove makes a big difference, and it only works every time. So why don't you? So God bless y'all richly and warmly, and smile for a stranger today. You'll both be glad you did, won't you? See that grin? Yeah. Any happy? <laughs>